sorry guys, I'm so sorry. Okay, we're back in business. Can we go a bit more? Can I go over that way? You headed over there. Yeah. Uh, Gotta get the boat. Is that good now? Can you can you check? I have to get the boat for tonight. Okay. Is that too much? Too much? No, that's okay. That's okay. Is that good?
se ti te moto tana o wetahi i roto i te nei au furi furi na atua e tu tai ha e wa o ma pakana i te hana o te whenua o te wa o maui i tiki a tāna Not moved, not uttered, a sound. So 
looked hard on her, gave her child to the sea, and whispered her heart. But the child lived, yet.
because now the pity pity news from when they sacrificed themselves upon the shore to protect the infant Maui. Yes, the pity pity new worm, the fearsome creatures that ruled the skies, striking terror into the hearts of the people as they roamed the lands on way for their human prey. It was the largest, most magnificent eagle to ever live. And it was known as the Poakai.
child home and hung him in the highest roof of his home where the warmth of the fire lingered the most. And so the child was revived and saved by Rangi the wise. The Pawaka raged for days, but wise old Rangi would not relent. As the seasons of the world rolled by, the child would grow strong, clever, and true.
names of my brothers. Well, from before I was born. Taha, Roto, Waho, Bye. Well, I guess I was wrong. I guess I'll be leaving now. Wait! Oh, you must be my Maui! Well, if it isn't little Maui, the guinea pig. I thought he died long ago. <laughs> that coming in when he was barely the size of a tui chicken when he was born. Are your eyes even open now?
it that you have learned the magic of transformation anyway, far away from your family, where none of your supposed brothers have ever done anything of this sort. Sounds like something an apostle would do. You get your ungrateful mess away from him.
should go absolutely batty with hunger and run wild. Probably end up rampaging away across the whole world. Apocalyptic, actually. We had been given the secret duty of feeding her and preventing it from ever happening. She'd end up eating everyone and everything she found. It would be a disaster, it would. She goes up first, we ever forgot. Like I said, she's incredibly powerful. What's her jawbone that's magical, mostly? She's not ordinary, Grandma. That's for sure. Take me to her. <gasps> Take you where? Please, I need that magical jawbone to get stronger. Try to go to her. She won't be able to chop you anymore. Will she?
at the last. Well, couldn't say I didn't see this coming.
planning to do. I'm going to teach that son a lesson so she can't cause any more suffering on herself. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, you're ready. Why don't you add another few planets to the solar system? Ha 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 ha! As if you put that on we eat you up and spit out your bones. <laughs> Laugh all you like, but you'll be thanking me later. But, well, I know you can go near the sun. Only the surface alone is nearly 6,000 degrees. Not to mention the core coming in at a blistering 15. <laughs> Million, it's just too hot. You'll be cooked to a crisp. You're forgetting I have this. Just wait and see. I'll have that sun begging for mercy and wishing it was never formed. But, man, we're wasting too much time. Remember what the Tortar said? The sun might just decide to go down any second now. If you're going to stay, you have to help. What can we do? It's going to get those ropes over there. They should already be planted good and strong, but they need to be strong.
I think you can release her now. I don't think she's going to cause any more trouble for us anymore. Anything last week either. 
Yes, you're right. It has been ages since any of us caught anything. That's why I've come. I know you've been sneaking off fishing without me. And you haven't caught anything for weeks. And just how do you think you'll be changing that? With this. I've been feeling even more powerful since I fought the sun. Cast your lines down as I say my cut a key. And you'll catch more fish than you can have.
pull on the fishing line was the signal. Oh, where? cried his brothers. He has a good catch of fish. He can lui to a little yaho, cried Ma. I have a great fish. He ya he ya he ya te ikan lui, chanted Ma. Pull, pull, pull the great fish. So it was that Maui did indeed catch a great fish. Te Ika a Maui, the fish of Maui, became the North Island of New Zealand.
with his mouth on his head. And big her fire once again. I'm not afraid. I'll go find so we can get the fire. It will not be an easy task. Your tricks will not work in my quicker. And she'll burn you alive if you try. For she is great and terrible and all bow before her power. Hmm. I understand. Thank you.
amazing. Okay, all the boy kids, shh, 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 shh. We're nearly there, you've been outstanding. I need everyone nice and quiet. I'm just gonna wait for everybody, because we have to thank a few really important people. Okay, looking good. Pretty amazing work though, we're so, so proud of them. So many kids to thank, we can't possibly do it because every single one of them has been a shining star, whether they've had a main part, a main part within their class, or whether they've been the really keen dancers in the groups. Every single one of our kids has been absolutely amazing. They're gonna be pretty tired. Um, so I'll come to a couple of important messages about tomorrow in a moment, but just really quickly, I'd love it if our staff if they're in the wings, they kind of like it in the wings, but if they could come out on stage, teachers, staff members, because these people are absolute superstars. They have been doing a phenomenal job the last few days, and behind the scenes, come on, put your hands up. <laughs> um, just can we give them a round of applause, because they really have been School has contributed to the show in many, many, many ways. So we are really thankful to the amazing staff that we have in our school. We've actually got a little something for Patrice. Where's Patrice? Oh, come on, Patrice, don't be shy. is it. This is her business and she's phenomenal and she's actually been uh, in Tauranga Moana helping schools do these amazing performances for years. I hate to guess how many years. Lots of years. Lots of years. My big teenage kids have been in these shows a long time ago so she's been around for a long time. This is a small thank you from us. You're just a ray of sunshine Patrice and we really consider you, consider you as part of the whānau at Pillins Point School so thank you so much. <laughs> by every single one of you, honestly, and you main characters. You brought me to tears tonight because tonight, actually, it is the record that Tauranga, this is my 28th Gosnet musical, and we did it in 13 days. Can we give them the biggest clap? But I know there's no way that we could do it without the most amazing support of parents. I know how much work you put in, especially to these main characters, and your kids at home to practice and practice. And thank you so much, parents. And I thank you for seeing the value in the performing arts. And to the beautiful, amazing, like my family, this is my fifth Girls Fan musical in Pillins Point. So you guys are like family now, and it's like when I come in, I just know. And you guys have been there, and you're here, and you're awesome, and you're amazing. And I had to put my dog down in my first week. It was like my ninth year I had shadow. And these teachers were here and I was fighting back tears every time I was done teaching. But you guys have just been there and you're awesome. So thank you so much. I just I really appreciate it. Nikki who was there and gave me snacks all the time. Kim and Lee just stay with me all the time and help me do all the little things. But can I, and also can I just say to the choir directors, please come out, Eloise and Louise. It takes so much effort to make those kids sound like the way they did. Where are they? Eloise and Louise come out. Seriously. they learn all their um, words and you guys sounded phenomenal so thank you to you guys so and I just want to say to you guys remember that anything is possible in life you guys every single one of you have been born to be great and to be amazing and do wonderful things you have to believe in yourself and do what you love in life because it's your passion that wins in the end don't ever compare yourself to others. I was never the best dancer in my class. I wasn't, but I loved it and I kept on going. I just kept on going. I was never the best singer, I was never the best actress, but I kept on going because I loved it. And it's your passion that will win, okay? Stick at that. Don't waste your life away watching Netflix and doing video games because it gets you nowhere. And it's a waste. you know is burning in your heart, 
If you do that, you'll make the world a better place around you and everyone will be better because you worked hard and did what you love. And the world will be a better place and it'll be amazing. Okay, so can you remember that? Remember that? And you guys are amazing and you did an amazing job living in 13 days. You guys are so awesome. Thank you so much to everybody. Thank you for everything. I think I've got everything. Thank you. amazing, eh? Lots of great messages. Okay, kids, eyes on me. I've got a couple of very boring messages, but important messages for your whanau. So can you just stay really quiet for me? That'll help me. Okay, okay so just a couple of quick messages. Uh, your, your children can be collected from the hall at the side. So when you exit, please um, go up the steps and follow around to the right. Uh, and you will follow the queue of people. So the, the students will be leaving the stage shortly with their teachers. Please give us a couple of minutes to get the costumes off, etc. And then they will be in lines waiting for you to collect them. Please just be patient with us and maybe stand back from the door a little bit because we're really serious about the health and safety and making sure every kid goes home with the right parent. Uh, the other thing too is that um, you are welcome if your child is really tired and they're pretty amazing and have had a couple of big days to start them late at school tomorrow by 11am. If you are going to do that, please notify the office. Uh, and the last thing I understand was, I think um, last night there was a problem with exiting with the gates. So I understand the gate, I'm just going to show you, that's in that corner of the school is locked at night, so you need to exit from this one here, the main entrance that comes along the side of the building. That's my last tip. Thank you so much for your presence tonight. We really appreciate your support. Ka kite. Dad. That's lots of love from Patrice too. Last one.